So there's an article that's been uh, floating around uh, that I finally got a chance to read about um, about uh, bloggers and specifically female bloggers. And I don't know why we have to <laughs> single out women for their content, but the the piece is rooted in this concern this this writer has about um, about the content people are taking in, and that online they could be taking in from these authors. Uh, stuff that's not helpful or stuff that's not true or maybe even misleading or damaging and the response like the, the sort of the prescribed response has to do with, with with creating systems of accountability around that existing culture around those existing blogs and bloggers which in a sense sort of comes around to like the, the response to bad culture being to to go fix that bad culture and I feel like you know what like I guess that's a way to deal with those kinds of things but if it is and I'm not sure it is but if it is it's at least a second best response the only real cure for what you consider bad culture is the creation of better culture so if you feel like the stuff people are taking in online isn't helpful if you're concerned about what people are reading taking in and consuming if you're concerned about the spiritual well-being of people as they respond to things online then get online create and support better culture. The only cure for bad culture is the creation and maintenance of better culture. See, I don't want to police people. I don't want to tell people where not to go. I want to create stuff that is good and true and beautiful and draw and invite people into that. I don't want to police folks. I want to shepherd. I want to love. I want to care for people.